Have you ever wondered where the whey protein powder you mix after a workout actually comes from? In fact, it starts with fresh drops of cow's milk, which then go through a long journey in a state-of-the-art factory before reaching your hands. Every day, tens of thousands of whey protein containers are produced, thanks to a combination of advanced technology and high-quality milk. Interestingly, this nutrient-rich powder used to be a byproduct of cheese making, but today, it has become a staple for fitness enthusiasts and anyone mindful of their health. To get a better understanding, today we're going on a special tour to explore the full, fascinating journey, from those fresh drops of milk all the way to the final whey protein product. The journey of whey protein begins at lush dairy farms, where cows are carefully cared for with a nutrient-rich diet and a clean, healthy environment. From the fresh milk collected each day, scientists have identified a valuable component within, protein. On average, cow's milk contains about 3 to 3.5% protein, most of which is casein, around 80%, while the remaining 20% is whey protein the very ingredient that forms the supplement you often use after workouts. Once milk is collected through modern automated systems, it's immediately chilled and stored in massive tanks to preserve freshness and limit bacterial growth. From the green pastures, fresh milk is quickly loaded onto specialized tanker trucks equipped with cooling systems, ensuring the temperature remains stable throughout the journey to the cheese processing plant. Upon arrival, the milk is received in a dedicated area and undergoes a series of rigorous tests, from protein and fat content to microbiological safety and antibiotic residues. Only batches that meet the highest standards are allowed to proceed down the production line, beginning their transformation into the nutritional products you know and use today. After passing the quality checks, the approved milk is pumped into massive storage tanks, kept at around 39 degrees Fahrenheit in preparation for pasteurization. At this stage, the milk passes through a modern heating system, quickly raising the temperature to about 161 to 180 degrees Fahrenheit within seconds, enough to kill harmful bacteria while preserving its nutritional value and natural flavor. Immediately afterward, the milk is cooled back down to 39 degrees Fahrenheit, ensuring it stays fresh. Once pasteurization is complete, the milk enters another crucial stage, the separation of its components. In large stirring tanks, the milk is kept in constant motion, preparing for the magical transformation to come. This stirring creates a mesmerizing dance where the milk's components gradually separate in a spectacular way. At this point, a special enzyme called rennet is added, extracted from the stomachs of young calves or lambs. In just a short moment, the milk begins to coagulate, forming soft white curds, while the liquid that separates out is whey, the precious ingredient we're exploring today. From here, the milk's journey splits in two. The curds continue to be processed and aged into rich, flavorful cheese. Meanwhile, the whey, the star of today's story, is sent down a separate production line where modern technology transforms it into the protein powder trusted by millions. When the liquid whey is separated from the milk, it still contains some unwanted fat, minerals, and carbohydrates. To refine it, the whey is passed through a modern membrane filtration system where millions of tiny pores act as gatekeepers, allowing protein to pass through while retaining other components. Technologies such as microfiltration and crossflow filtration are commonly used, increasing the purity of whey without the need for chemicals or high heat. Thanks to this process, whey protein retains its full structure along with the valuable nutrients naturally found in milk. After filtration, the whey becomes much more protein dense, ready for the next stage, concentration through evaporation. In massive evaporation chambers, water is gradually removed under strict control of temperature and pressure. This ensures that the protein remains undenatured, preserving its original quality. 
As the water is removed, what remains is a concentrated, bright, and pure protein-rich whey solution, the foundation for the whey protein powder we are all familiar with. Once concentrated, the whey enters its final stage, spray drying. In massive drying chambers, the liquid whey is transformed into tiny mist-like droplets, almost like fine raindrops. When these droplets meet hot air, the moisture evaporates almost instantly, leaving behind light white and fine protein particles. These are then cooled and collected in powder form. Thanks to spray drying technology, whey protein retains its original nutritional value while achieving a smooth texture and excellent solubility. After being concentrated and dried, whey protein has now become a fine powder. However, to reach its final standard, the powder still goes through a few more finishing steps. First, it is sieved to remove any oversized or uneven particles. Next, the powder enters a massive mixing machine where the fine particles blend together, remaining moisture is eliminated, and a uniform, stable mixture is formed. Once it meets the quality standards, the whey is carefully packaged into 20 kilogram bags or large sacks weighing up to 500 kilograms. From the pure whey bags, the ingredient is sent to modern processing plants. Here, tens of thousands of finished products are created daily to meet market demand. Whey doesn't stand alone. It is carefully blended with other ingredients such as lactose, fats, minerals, vitamins, and flavorings. This mix not only enhances nutritional value, but also gives each product its unique taste. In massive stainless steel mixing tanks, the blend is stirred by gently rotating paddles to achieve perfect uniformity. The mixture is then transferred to high-speed centrifuge tanks for about 15 minutes. This process eliminates separation and ensures that all components are fully integrated. Once these steps are complete, the tanks are lifted to prepare for filling and packaging. Once the whey mixture is ready, it is moved to the filling area, where every operation is meticulously controlled down to the last gram. Automated machines work continuously, filling the powder into each container quickly while maintaining absolute accuracy. Immediately afterward, the containers pass through electronic scales to ensure that no product exceeds or falls short of the allowed weight. Next, the conveyor belt carries the containers to the labeling stage. Here, each whey protein container receives its coat of information, nutritional facts, usage instructions, expiration date, production batch number, and more. This allows consumers to easily track and feel confident in their choice. Whey protein today isn't limited to jars or cans. It's also packaged in convenient bags. This format not only reduces production and shipping costs, but also offers a wide range of shapes, colors, and sizes. Lightweight, compact, and easy to store bags provide a fresh, flexible experience for modern consumers. Finally, they are packaged into batches and neatly arranged on transport shelves, ready to reach gyms, nutrition stores, and ultimately, consumers seeking a reliable source of energy for their workouts and overall health. So, we've followed the entire journey, from pure fresh milk to the finished containers of whey protein, Behind each product is a high-tech process, strict quality control, and the dedication of the people working in the factory. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit like to show your support, subscribe to the channel, and turn on notifications so you won't miss any of our exciting exploration journeys. Thanks for joining us today, and we'll see you in the next video.